I kept giving tests mm. and realized which topics I was making silly mistakes. Correct. Doing the mock test will boost your confidence and also let you know what your topics are weak. Revise every day. Do not leave a single day without any revision. Do not panic during the exam. Hello students, welcome to the next episode of Baiju's Exam Prep Spotlight and in this spotlight, in this video, I have Mr. Arijay Dev with him. He has secured All India Rank 5 in Computer Science in GATE 2023. Yes guys, a single digit rank holder is in front of you and I just hope that this video is going to, lot of, give, going to give you a lot of detailed insights about this examination, how to be in the top ranks, what is the preparation strategy followed by Arijit. So first of all, Arijit, welcome to the show. And congratulations for this big success. Thank you. Thank so, uh, Arijit, before we start off any discussions, I want to tell you about your students. Ko hai, where do you come from? And how did you conquer this journey? Ko konkar kiya? Everything about yourself. Hello, everyone. I am Arijit De. I am from Mumbai. I have uh, cleared gate 2023 exam and secured rank 5. Arijit, my you know, first question to you would be like, you know, getting a single digit rank. So I, I definitely believe you must have studied in total detail about this examination. Also, let me ask you your marks. Exactly how many marks you have secured? 87.67. 87.67. So yeah, that is what, you know, conquering, you know, almost 87.67 marks in the gate examination. So what your approach was, how you made the concepts clear, because this is an exam, you know, prepared mm -hmm. by IITs and IISC. So they really go into depth of the concepts at many of the times. So what was your approach of preparation first regarding to the concepts especially? So... Last year also I have given gate exam. Oh, all right. And uh, there I had not prepared well. Okay. I had not done revision properly. Okay. Didn't give any mock test. Right. But this year I had uh, thought to not make those mistakes okay. again. So I did my revisions properly each and every day. Mm. Gave a lot of mock tests. Mm. And uh, by analyzing the result of those mock tests, I was able to find out my weak topics, okay. my strong topics, hmm. and then prepare accordingly. All right. So, uh, what was your rank last year, as you mentioned? Last year was 778. 778. And you were in final year that time? Yeah. Right. So, the best part about that I'm able to catch capture is, you know, because at this time also many students, especially those who have given gate 23, they all, some of the students might have got ranks like you 700 or even some of them might have got 2000, 3000 ranks and they are in the always in the dilemma key whether to take a drop or not. So, I think you have given a very appropriate, you have taken a very appropriate decision and you have given a very appropriate answer ki aapne apne mistakes ko identify kiya ki aapko laga revision kam tha, mm -hmm. aapko laga mock test kam diye the, at least you know, mm -hmm. and aap, aapko ye pata tha ki aap agar main second effort dunga to I'll come up with the best. So I think mujhe lagta hai ki jo log bhi is dilemma mein hai na ki drop lena chahiye ki nahi lena chahiye unke liye yahi answer hona chahiye. Search if you know ki aapke paas mistakes thi jinke paas aap overcome kar sakte ho to definitely aap next year acha perform kar loge. Theek hai so uh, ab is second preparation cycle mein kya ek decision tough tha drop lene ke liye did you lose your patience sometime ya sab kuch rest calm and composed tha preparation cycle mein. Last year just before the exam hmm. I had already made up my mind that I will be giving a drop. Okay. So I had told my parents, right. they were a little reluctant about it, but I convinced them hmm. and I knew that I will, I will be able to get a okay. much decent rank. Great, great, great. So good, good self-belief on yourself and you convinced. So, you know, you believed on yourself, you convinced your parents or aapne pura drop liya din raat mehnat ki to what eventually is there in the mind? Matlab, what Arijit wanted, jiske liye itni mehnat aya, where do you want to go after getting this rank? Um, during my BTEC years only, I had decided that I will be going for higher studies. Okay. To do my MTech from top IITs. All right. And at that time, one of my friends who was a senior mm. was also preparing for GATE. Okay. So from him, I took inspiration okay. and also decided to go ahead. All right. So which IIT, the dream IIT for Arijit? IIT Bombay. IIT Bombay, great. So you will get it undoubtedly. So, uh, you know, uh, of course, uh, you have prepared twice. First time, you have not had time. Mm -hmm. de pae. But throughout this, what was the role of practice? Matlab, whether it was your first or second attempt, what do you believe uh, practice is an important role play? Karta hai? And from where did you practice? Practice was really, really important. Mm. During my last year, I didn't practice much. Mm. So during the exam, I was a little nervous. Mm. I was panicking. Mm. I was making silly mistakes. Mm. But uh, this year, I didn't make a single silly mistake. Okay. Like Great. all the all the questions that I attempted, hmm. not a single negative mark. Okay. So yeah. that that's great. So you know to come up to this stage, ki there is no negative marks, so there is no silly mistakes. Uh, 
you know, definitely you must have given lots of tests also in your preparation journey. Yeah. Right. Uh, so, you know, you focused only on mock test or topic test, subject test also you uh, have given? Both of them. Both of them. All including, I had given around 40 tests. Okay, all including. Yeah. Right. So, uh, primarily, aapko kya lagta hai? what do we learn from test? Kya role a test series ka ek student ke liye? Like after giving the test, that post analysis that comes with it, mm. um, we can identify what our weak topics are, right. what our strong topics are. Right. So looking at those weak topics, we can focus more on them Correct. and improve ourselves. Correct. And looking at the strong topics, we can gain confidence, self-confidence. Mm. Yeah, that is what it, it has both the areas, confidence booster also and uh, sort of able to learn from your mistakes and that is mm -hmm. very crucial part because students don't understand this, they just uh, do, discard the test series part, they will believe that they will give it later and that later never comes and unless and until you give the test, you never know your shortcomings. Also, you don't know your strong areas also. When you go into the exam hall, it is very necessary that you know what your strength is and if you have any weakness, then you have to first you test series ke through samaj chuke ho ki ye weak areas and you have worked over it okay and then only you are able to get the marks like you know in the range of 87 88 mm -hmm. okay aur is level tak aap apne aap ko le aaye ki bilkul bhi aapne mistakes nahi kiya silly mistakes bilkul nahi aaya that's really an you know commendable job and congratulations for that mm -hmm. thank you hana koi koi kitna bhi top pe chale jaye somehow we make mistake maybe one mark also but you have achieved you have you know achieved not doing it great so uh, Arijit, uh, test series ke time pe, gate mein to aapne acha perform kiya, but test series ke time mein kabhi koi aisa time tha ki where you are scoring less in the test, in mock test you scored less or something, yeah. did you face any such time? So, one of the topics, computer networks, Okay. Uh, I was really bad at it. Okay. <laughs> it was really complicated for me. Alright. But I kept giving tests hmm. and realized which topics I was making silly mistakes. Correct. And practiced more questions on that. Hmm. And finally I was able to make that weak topic yeah that is what you know topper ki quality hoti that you can't leave the weak area first you have to know the weak area and then you have to uh, rectify it or other than the weak area kabhi marks come in test mein mock test mein did you face any time ki where by chance you scored less marks in the mock test or in the uh, subject no. test it was all good all so good. so we can say that if you are performing good in the mock test you will be performing good in gate this is proportional yes but uh, there is a chance that during the actual exam people might panic. Yes, exactly. How how Arijit was feeling on the exam day? Before the exam hall, go, before going to the exam hall and during the exam hall? Mm, I was not nervous actually. <laughs> I was well prepared. Right. I knew that I will be getting a decent rank. Right. And I just gave the exam. Can I, can I ask you one thing like, you know, during my time also, you know, when I prepared, one of my uh, professor who knew me closely, uh, he just told me one week before the examination that, uh, you know, Rakesh, I don't know what exact rank can be. Nobody can predict it. But definitely your rank is going to be under 50. That is what he just gave me. I also didn't think that much. And I actually got ninth rank. Did you also have some intuition? Or did somebody tell you that you are in this bracket? Did you have confidence? Aa gaya tha kya? Uh, before the exam, I had actually thought that I will be getting top 100 rank. Okay. After the exam, I thought the exam went really well, hmm. but I thought that other for other students also the exam will go Correct. well. Correct. So after the answer key came out hmm. and I evaluated my answer key with that original answer key hmm. and I found out my marks, then I realized that, okay, I can get top 10. Yes, that is what, correct. Yeah, but at least before going to the exam, we get a clear cut idea. That is why, you know, preparation matters a lot. That gives you confidence. You know, you will be under 50, under 100. You are going with that confidence. And if you are going with that confidence, you will not panic. Karoge. The main important mm -hmm. thing is that you have tested a lot, you have practiced a lot. But if those three hours you panic, then stories yeah. will turn about in the story. Mein. Right. So, uh, you know, how do you come to know about Baiju's? Matlab, how did you come to know uh, about this? For one of my friends okay. was also preparing for GATE. All right. And from him, I got to know about it. So he was computer science student only? Yeah. Okay, great. So then what is the product you have used from Baiju's? How it helped you? Classroom program. Classroom program. Yeah. So you followed all classroom programs? Yeah, I have tried to. Okay, like but mostly you have followed. Mostly I have So uh, could you follow during the, well, it was a live batch for you, na? I yeah. think you will be in the vision batch. Yeah. Correct. So, were you able to manage time to follow live or you were watching it later on? What was your uh, approach? Actually, I was watching the recorded classes okay. later on. Later on. To save time. But yeah, but mostly you are following classes with yeah. honesty. So, yeah. how the classes helped you in concepts and practice? Like, uh, before the attending those classes, I had some concepts which were not very clear. Okay. But after attending classes, I realized that the concepts that I had was very less. Okay. 
and those improved me chalo great great so great to know that you know by just directly classroom program helped you succeeding uh, getting this particular rank also at the same time did you follow the daily quizzes that are there with the class or you just mm-hmm. used to follow the no class? daily quizzes i used to follow okay daily quizzes so they also helped you in some yeah. sense yeah all right so great so uh, what was your revision approach because you mentioned in the beginning ki last yeah. year revision nahi hua tha sahi se hmm. to is baar definitely aapne us cheez ka dhyan rakha hoga yeah. so your approach for revision so i would say practice uh, revise every day hmm. uh, do not leave any single day without any revision hmm. if you revise you will not forget topics hmm. and that's all right correct so uh, did you make any short notes and all for revision kuch aisa tha I only made notes for those topics that I considered difficult. Difficult. Other topics I had just never made any notes. Okay, okay, great. So uh, great. मतलब you focused on revision part as well. Test तो आपने बहुत अच्छे से दिया ही है. Practice you made it solid. So for practice, did you follow the workbooks uh, that were provided yeah, by yeah. Byju's? I have like solved almost ninety percent of the questions there. Uh, for the workbooks, mm-hmm. right? So what do you believe uh, the, the questions helped you? The, did you find new types of new varieties yeah, of questions? Yeah, new varieties of questions were there. it was interesting very interesting and especially msq questions are also there yeah and you know in computer science every year we have seen msq question they are even last year 15 msqs mm-hmm. this year also i think around 15 msqs yeah. so computer science even from the first year computer science is getting good number of psqs to F, msqs 12 to F15 12 to 15 so you know you have to be prepared on msq so what is the msq level in the gate exam for computer science especially because every time almost 12 15 it's a big number so kya wo bahut difficult msq hote hain ya moderate level mm. MSQs are not that difficult hmm. if your concepts are clear Correct. and if you like take it slow hmm. you will be able to answer them correctly right and jahan tak mera update hai arjit like last year also you appeared last year i think computer science paper was little better this hmm. time it became little easy hmm. so matlab preparation kaisa hona chahiye mix of good questions or only easy question because paper kaisa bhi aa sakta hai it is unpredictable they can give very easy sometimes they can give good paper so how a student approach should be Like students should always keep in mind that the question paper should be can be tough. Correct. And then approach it. Because if you are prepared for tough, you are prepared for everything. Yeah. Right. So uh, yeah, great listening to you, Arijit. So you know your final words for uh, fellow gate aspirants because you know many students will be appearing in gate twenty four, gate twenty five. They'll be watching you. So according to you, what are three or four most important things that every student must follow? Your advice will matter a lot to them. So what are three or four important things? Uh. like i said revise every day do not leave a single day without any revision so that you don't forget during the exam give a lot of mock tests giving those mock tests will boost your confidence and also let you know what your topics are weak and you can focus on them more and do not panic during the exam that's all so thank you once again arijit uh, for joining the byju's exam prep show and i congratulate you once again for this big success of yours and uh, i wish you luck for uh, your course in iit bombay and hope you get your dream placements there and guys uh, ye tha next spotlight jahan pe aapne all india rank 5 computer science ki story suni how important the revision part is arijit ne focus kiya kaise exam hall mein apne aap ko cool calm and composed rakhna hai because that 3 hours going to really decide your entire uh, career as well but ha uske pehle agar aapki rock solid preparation hai so then nothing is going to lose out on that So thank you for joining the Byju's exam prep spotlight thank you once again Arijit and I hope this video uh, gives several important tips to the students thank you